Good morning and welcome to our morning prayer for Tuesday the 26th of May when we remember St Augustine, the first Archbishop of Canterbury. O Lord, open thou our lips and our mouth shall proclaim your praise. Send your Holy Spirit upon us and clothe us with power from on high. Alleluia. Blessed are you, Creator God, to you be praise and glory for ever. As your spirit moved over the face of the waters, bringing light and life to your creation, pour out your spirit on us today, that we may walk as children of light, and by your grace reveal your presence. Blessed be God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Blessed be God for ever. We now hear some verses from Psalm 100. Be joyful in the Lord all the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness and come before his presence with a song. Know that the Lord is God. It is he that has made us and we are his. We are his people and we are the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and bless his holy name. For the Lord is gracious, his love is steadfast and everlasting, and his faithfulness endures from generation to generation. The Lord is gracious, his steadfast love is everlasting. O Christ, door of the sheepfold, may we enter your gates with praise and go from your courts to serve you in the poor, in the lost and in the wandering this day and all the days of our life. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be for evermore. Amen. Come Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your people and kindle in us the fire of your love. All who are led by the Spirit of God are children of God and fellow heirs with Christ. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your people. Renew the face of creation, O Lord, pouring on us the gifts of your Spirit. Kindle in us the fire of your love. For the creation waits with eager longing for the glorious liberty of the children of God. Come, Holy Spirit, Fill the hearts of your people and kindle in us the fire of your love. Amen. So now we come to our prayers. After each bidding, we will keep a moment of silence for our own private thoughts and prayers. Let us pray. So Lord, we pray for this day ahead, all its work and its tasks. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. We pray for our world and for the leaders of the nations. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Father God, we pray especially for the churches in this community of the Cookhams, for their witness at this time. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord, we uphold to your healing light all who are sick and in need of renewal through you at this time. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Lord, we pray for all who are bereaved and sorrowful. And we uplift to you all those who have died in the faith of Christ and all those who have died alone or whose faith is known to you alone. Lord, may the departed rest in peace and rise in glory. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. And finally, Lord, in a moment we bring our own needs and concerns before you. Lord, in your mercy, 
hear our prayer. Merciful Father, accept these prayers for the sake of your Son, our Saviour, Jesus Christ. Amen. And now our special collect for today. Almighty God, whose servant Augustine was sent to be the apostle of the English people, grant that as he laboured in the spirit to preach Christ's gospel in this land, so all who hear the good news may strive to make your truth known in all the world, through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and for ever. Amen. And so being made one in the power of the Spirit, let us pray with confidence as our Saviour has taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil, for thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. May the Spirit kindle in us the fire of Christ's love. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Alleluia, alleluia. Thanks be to God. Alleluia, alleluia. Stay safe and God bless. <laughs>